Hello and welcome to the third video in this series and we'll be looking at how to make a program that uses if statements. So basically uh, just start with making your project and make sure it's Windows from application selected and just name it if statements. Okay. Now basically what if statement is it basically means that it's like if text let me give an example. So if text box one dot text equals hello then then you choose whatever call to execute you might have the program closes program that shows the message box whatever you choose so um for this to work let's just add a text box and a button and you can also use things like check boxes and radio buttons but for this uh, we're just keeping it simple as a tutorial as a sorry third tutorial and just name it um whatever you want like start the coding so just double click this and then um okay let's make some space and so an if statement basically as I explained is that if text box one is equal to da 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 then some code will execute so if text box one dot text equals hello then message box dot show hi so basically what that means is if the text of text box one, which is this thing here, uh, equals hello, then a message box will show with the text hi. Now another more advanced thing to uh, if statements, but it's not that advanced and it's quite easy to grasp, is else. That basically means if anything else is in text box one, then it will uh, do this code, it will do whatever code you execute, so box.show wrong answer so let's just check that now so if we run this so let's just enter some rubbish it will say wrong answer and then if we do hello it will say hi so um that's this uh, if statements tool uh, if you don't really understand it um uh, watch it again or, or just leave a comment and i'll answer it so um look at the next videos and i hope this video was of use to you and just remember to say uh, go to save all here and we'll save it in my documents and if you are going to uh, produce a exe file to give people which i'll show how to do it in a further tutorial you have to build it all right so thanks for watching and just look at some other tutorials